The National Weather Service in Wilmington has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Boone County, Campbell County, Carroll County, Gallatin County, Grant County, Kenton County, Owen County, Pendleton County, until 8 p.m. At 7.08 p.m., National Weather Service Doppler radar indicated a line of severe thunderstorms capable of producing penny-size hail and winds to 60 miles an hour. These storms were located along a line extending from Petersburg to Rabbit Hash to Prestonville, moving southeast at 40 miles an hour. Locations in the path of the storm include Warsaw, Burlington, Oak Brook, Union, Florence, Villa Hills, Ellesmere, Crescent Springs. In addition, Bellevue, Rabbit Hash, Interstate 71 at State Route 227, English, Langstaff, U.S. Route 42 at State Route 184, Easter Day, and Waterloo are near the path of these severe thunderstorms. In addition to large hail and damaging winds, frequent cloud-to-ground lightning is occurring. Move indoors immediately. Remember, lightning can strike out to 15 miles from the parent thunderstorm. If you can hear thunder, you are close enough to be struck by lightning. Please report hail or strong winds to the National Weather Service by calling toll-free 877-633-6772 when you can do so safely. The National Weather Service in Wilmington has issued a flood advisory for Franklin County until 8.30 p.m. At 6.26 p.m., Doppler radar indicated thunderstorms with heavy rain continuing to move across Franklin County. Radar estimated that one to two inches had fallen across the western half of Franklin County since 5.30 p.m. Additional thunderstorms to the northwest will progress into the county over the next 60 to 90 minutes with the potential for producing another one to two inches. Small creeks and streams, highways and underpasses, as well as country roads and farmland along the banks of creeks and streams will experience minor flooding. Motorists should use caution. Do not attempt to cross areas where water of unknown depth covers the road. This watch includes the following counties in Indiana, Dearborn, Fayette, Franklin, Ohio, Ripley, Switzerland, and Union, and the following counties in Kentucky, Boone, Bracken, Campbell, Carroll, Gallatin, Grant, Kenton, Mason, Owen, Pendleton, and Robertson, and the following counties in Ohio, Brown, Butler, Claremont, Clinton, Hamilton, Highland, and Warren. Remember, a severe thunderstorm watch means that conditions are favorable for the development of severe weather, including large hail and damaging winds, and in close to the wash area. While severe weather may not be imminent, persons should remain alert for rapidly changing weather conditions and listen for later statements and possible warnings. Stay tuned to NOAA Weather Radio, commercial radio and television outlets or internet sources for the latest severe weather information. Repeating, severe thunderstorm wash number 716 has been issued from 11.40 a.m. until 7 p.m. for the following counties in Indiana. Dearborn, Fayette, Franklin, Ohio, Ripley, Switzerland, and Union, and the following counties in Kentucky, Boone, Bracken, Campbell, Cattle, Gallatin, Grant, Kenton, Mason, Owen, Pendleton, and Robertson, and the following counties in Ohio, Brown, Butler, Claremont, Clinton, Hamilton, Highland, and Warren. <coughs> The National Weather Service in Wilmington has issued a tornado warning for Boone County, Campbell County, Kenton County, until 8 p.m. At 7.25 p.m., National Weather Service Doppler radar indicated a severe thunderstorm capable of producing a tornado. This dangerous storm was located near Cincinnati Northern Kentucky International Airport, moving southeast at 40 miles an hour. Locations in the path of the storm include Crescent Springs, Ellesmere, Berlinger, Lakeside Park, Crestview Hills, Fort Mitchell, Park Hills, Fort Wright. In addition, Crescent Park, Richwood, Kenton Vale, Ricedale, Banklick, Fairview, Latonia Lakes and White Tower are near the path of this dangerous thunderstorm. If you are near the path of this storm, take cover now. Move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Mobile homes and vehicles should be abandoned for more substantial shelter. Avoid windows, please report tornadoes, final clouds, strong winds or hail to the National Weather Service by calling toll-free 877-633-6772 when you can do so safely. Here is a public information statement. The 2009 annual Kentucky...
Kentucky statewide tornado drill is scheduled. Tomorrow, Tuesday, March 3rd, as a part of the drill, the National Weather Service in Wilmington, Ohio will send out a special weather statement with information about the test tornado drill. The Wilmington National Weather Service will also activate the NOAA weather radios at Covington, Owenton, and Maysville, Kentucky in Scioto County, Ohio using the routine weekly test, RWT code and will transmit a message for the Kentucky statewide tornado drill. The RWT code on the NOAA weather radio will be set to alert. If you have any questions, please contact Mary Jo Parker, Warning Coordination Meteorologist, National Weather Service, Wilmington, Ohio, at Mary Parker at NOAA. The National Weather Service in Wilmington has issued a flash flood warning for the following counties, Boone, Campbell, Kenton, Claremont, Eastern Hamilton, until 7.15 p.m. At 4.11 p.m., radar indicated that thunderstorms had produced heavy rainfall across the warned area. Radar and drain gauges indicated that up to 1.5 inches. The Climate Summary for Cincinnati on Saturday, January 14th. The high temperature was 29 at 5 p.m. The low temperature was 18 at 9.31 a.m. The mean temperature was 24 and the departure from normal was minus 7. There were 41 heating degree days. The departure from normal was plus 7. The monthly total was 422 and the departure was minus 54. The seasonal total was 2,068, and the departure was minus 327. There were 0.01 inches of precipitation reported. The total precipitation for the month was 0.91 inches. The departure from normal was minus 0.47 inches. The yearly total was 0.91 inches. The departure from normal was minus 0.47 inches. There were 0.2 inches of snowfall reported. The total for the month is 1.6 inches, and the seasonal total is 2.0 inches. The normal high for today is 38. The normal low for today is 23. The record high for today is 65, set in 1950. The record low for today is minus 11, set in 1972. Sunrise today is at 7.56 a.m. Sunset today is at 5.39 p.m. Sunrise tomorrow will be at 7.56 a.m. Sunset tomorrow will be at 5.40 p.m. By the midnight weather conditions at the Cincinnati, Northern Kentucky International Airport, freezing rain and fog reported. The temperature was 29 degrees and the relative humidity 92 percent. The wind northeast at 13 miles an hour, creating a wind chill of 19. The barometric pressure was 29.86 inches and steady. And now the conditions for selected locations in Ohio, Kentucky, and Indiana. At Lunkin Airport, freezing rain and fog, and 30. In Wilmington, light freezing rain and fog, and 23. At Hamilton, freezing rain, and 28. In Blue Ash, mostly cloudy, and 30. In Dayton, light freezing rain and fog, and 21. Over in Indianapolis, freezing rain and sleet, and 23. And at Louisville, cloudy, and 34. At Falmouth, mixed precipitation, and 28. Once again at midnight, at the Cincinnati, Northern Kentucky International Airport, it was 29 degrees with a wind chill of 19, with freezing rain and fog. Here is a public information statement. The Indiana Statewide Tornado Drill will be held Wednesday, March 21st. The drill will occur at approximately 10.15 a.m. and again at approximately 7.35 p.m. The National Weather Service Office in Wilmington will issue a special weather statement, or SBS, with the drill tornado warning wording. This special weather statement will be aired on No Weather Radio, and we use the routine weekly test, or RWD, code. If your No Weather Radio is set to alert for the weekly test for any Indiana county, then your No Weather Radio will alarm for the Indiana Statewide Tornado Drill. The Statewide Tornado Drill is a great time to exercise your safety plan, if possible, or at least to take time to review your plan. Make sure everyone knows what the plan is and how to carry it out. Determine the safer places of shelter at your location before severe weather strikes. If you have questions, contact Mary Jo Parker, Warning Coordination Meteorologist, National Weather Service Forecast Office, Wilmington, Ohio, at 937-383-0031. Or email at mary.parker at noaa.gov. Thursday, cloudy with a 40% chance of snow showers. Highs around 40. Northwest winds 10 to 15 miles an hour. 
Thursday night, cloudy with a 30% chance of snow hours. Lows in the upper 20s. Northwest winds 5 to 10 miles an hour. And Friday, cloudy with scattered flurries. Highs in the upper 30s. It is a public information statement. The Kentucky Statewide Tornado Drill will be held this morning. The drill will occur at approximately 10.07 a.m. The National Weather Service Office in Wilmington will issue a special weather statement, or SBS, containing the drill tornado warning wording. This product will be aired on No Weather Radio, and we use the routine weekly test, or RWD, code. If your No Weather Radio is set to alert for the weekly test for any Kentucky County, then your No Weather Radio will alarm for the Kentucky Statewide Tornado Drill. The Statewide Tornado Drill is a great time to exercise your safety plan, if possible, or at least take time to review your plan. Make sure everyone knows what the plan is and how to carry it out. Determine the safer places of shelter at your location before severe weather strikes. If you have questions, contact Mary Jo Parker, Warning Coordination Meteorologist at the National Weather Service in Wilmington by calling 937-383-0031. is a test. Repeat, this is a test tornado warning. There is no severe weather occurring at this time. This test warning is part of the annual Ohio tornado drill. People can take this time to initiate their preparedness plans. This is a test to help you prepare for severe weather. Think about where you would go and what you would do in the event of an actual tornado. Repeating, this has been a test tornado warning for the 2013 Ohio tornado drill. We now will resume our normal programming. It is a public information statement. Indiana statewide tornado drills are scheduled for today. The drill will occur at approximately 7.35 p.m. The National Weather Service office in Wilmington will issue a special weather statement, SBS, with the drill tornado warning wording. This special weather statement will be aired on No Weather Radio, and we use the routine weekly test, RWD, code. If your No Weather Radio is set to alert for the weekly test for any of National Weather Service Wilmington's Indiana counties, then your No Weather Radio will alarm for the Indiana Statewide Tornado Drill. The Statewide Tornado Drill is a great time to exercise your safety plan, if possible, or at least to take time to review your plan. Make sure everyone knows what the plan is and how to carry it out. Determine the safer places of shelter at your location before severe weather strikes. If you have any questions, contact National Weather Service, Weather Forecast Office, Wilmington, Ohio, 937-383-0031. Record low temperature broken at Cincinnati. The low temperature Tuesday morning, April 2nd at the Cincinnati Northern Kentucky International Airport was 22 degrees. This broke the low temperature record, which was 23 degrees in 1961. The climate summary for Cincinnati. On Tuesday, April 2nd, the high temperature was 47 at 5.46 p.m. The low temperature was 22 at 7.25 a.m. The mean temperature was 35, and the departure from normal was minus 15. The low temperature broke the old record of 23 set in 1961. There were 30 heating degree days. The departure from normal all hazards KZZ-49, Maysville, Kentucky, operating on a frequency of 162.425 MHz, may temporarily be off the air between midnight and 5 a.m. Monday, August 19th, due to scheduled phone circuit maintenance. We apologize for any inconvenience. This is the hazardous weather outlook. Please listen to NOAA Weather Radio or go to weather.gov on the internet for more information and statements about the ongoing winter weather system tonight and early Saturday. Snow showers will continue on Saturday, but additional accumulations will be light. Wind chill values around zero are possible Saturday night into Sunday morning. Weather spotters are encouraged to report snow accumulations to the National Weather Service. Pearl Airport, Ohio and Economy in Wayne County, Indiana both falling to 48 degrees. Five points in Warren County, Ohio reached 49 degrees. Low temperatures fell within five degrees of the record at the official Cincinnati, Columbus, and Dayton climate sites. The low at Cincinnati was 59, and the record is 56. At Columbus, the low was 56, and the record is 52. 
for Dayton, the low is 52, and the record is 50. For additional low temperatures, please visit our website at weather.gov slash ALN, as well as our Facebook and Twitter pages. Here are the 10 a.m. weather conditions. The report from Cincinnati was not available. In Hillsboro, cloudy and 64. Once again at 10 a.m., the report from Cincinnati was not available. Here are the 4 p.m. weather conditions. The report from Cincinnati was not available. At Lebanon, cloudy and 28. Up in Columbus, no flurries and 29. Once again at 4 p.m., the report from Cincinnati was not available. In the upper 70s, lows in the mid 60s, chance of rain 30%. 30%. Monday night, partly cloudy. Including the greater Cincinnati tri-state area. Tonight, clear QWITH widespread frost after midnight. Lows in the lower 30s.